case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Caught in a legal tug of war regarding the ownership of two tracts of land were heirs of the original land granters and a school district in a case heard by the Kansas Supreme Court in 1982. Known as Roberts v. Rhodes, the dispute centered around the future use of the land that had been devoted to the school and cemetery purposes for more than 60 years. At issue were details of the original deeds. Those grants did not specify what should occur with the land if no longer used for a school. The plaintiffs claimed title, stating they obtained ownership via deeds from the original grantor's heirs and by the fact that the property was no longer serving its original purpose, thus asserting reversion. Contrarily, the defendants, Rhodes, who acquired the land from the school district, insisted that the land belonged to the school district from which they purchased it. The tug of war on ownership took a turn in the Court of Appeals, where the ruling landed in favor of the defendants, asserting that the school district had absolute ownership due to an absence of limitations in the deeds. This effectively reversed a previous decision by the district court which had held in favor of the plaintiffs, stating the tract would revert to the original grantors if no longer in use for school purposes. The Kansas Supreme Court ultimately ruled that a quit-claim deed given without any limitations firmly established fee simple title in the beneficiaries, in this case, the school district. Even after discontinuation of the specified use, the ownership was intact due to the decades of use for school purposes. This decision overturned the district court, thus validating the Court of Appeals ruling, though with two judges dissenting. In conclusion, the land battle in Roberts v. Rhodes underscored the stipulation that long-term use of the property for a specified purpose without any limitations establishes ownership. In this case, the school district's 60-year utilization undoubtedly upheld their ownership claim over the contested land. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.